With our hands, we wave, touch, extend, express, hold, pray, protect. With our hands, we can open doors. And with our hands, we can pull people in. But it's easier said than done, right? It's risky to extend a hand to another. What if they refuse to take it? And if they take it, what if they take it in a way we didn't expect or want? While we try to pull them up, what if they pull us down? What if we always have to keep extending, keep helping, keep offering our hands time and time and time again without any change or gratitude or obvious reason to continue? It's risky to bring someone in our lives, to let them share in our experiences, to reach beyond our walls and become vulnerable to them. It's much more comfortable to hold someone at the safe distance of an arm's length, to serve without getting involved, to instruct instead of construct. So why work to do this at all? Because Jesus did. With his hands, he invited, washed, lifted, healed, set free, put together, transformed, bled. He risked this knowing he would be refused in the end by all of us. He risked this because he dared to believe fully in the Father's vision. He risked because he had no fear. He risked because he knew only love. His kind of love believes, hopes, and trusts that all things are possible through God. So what do we do with our hands?